Are you making this up, please? The samples collected from the scene certainly could indicate a wafer-like material. It had me confused at first, but of course, wafer makes perfect sense. Oh, yes. Wafer makes perfect sense for the kitty cat. But for the rest of us who aren't crazy, it's a bit hard to swallow. It's the truth that's crazy, not me. Because the truth is stranger than fiction. Really? It's highly probable that the culprit is... Someone used to cooking cakes and pastries on a grand scale. In other words, a confectioner. We're looking for a master wafer maker. Oh, you again. What do you want now? Well, Mr. Lipsky, it's about the person responsible for the missing hour hand. Me? It's you, isn't it? <laughs> what are you talking about? This is not fair, you can't pick on me. What evidence? If it's evidence you want, how about this? It's... it's drawing of hand! I believe you made this, didn't you? As a plan for your brother, who had you make a giant clock hand out of wafer biscuit. I was not enough careful, like idiot. I made stew. I dropped the hand, and it was broken. Now Ambassador is coming, and we are in pickle. So you came up with the idea of a wafer hand to buy you some time? No, yes. It was only thing I could think of. But my Bratsy is not to blame. It was all my idea. Bratsy, no. I thought a plan, not you. Quiet, Alex. I told you just follow what I say. <laughs> it's really very charming. Uh, huh? The idea of a giant clock hand made of wafer. It's a wonderful notion. <laughs> uh, still, I did not tell truth. I made big mistake. Now, I don't know what me and my Bratsy can do. Oh, that's easy. Easy? Yes, make another one. We'll present your wonderful wafer clock hand to the ambassador as a gift. What foreign dignitary wouldn't be delighted by a life-sized replica of a piece of one of Britain's most iconic landmarks? Uh -huh. Thank you. 